Hello, this is Andy with AMA Marketer. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to use the new QR code builder inside of Go High Level. Let's get started. All right, so the first place you need to look to go find the QR code builder is on the left-hand side, go to Sites. And as you're in Sites, you'll see with the new right over here, QR code, you just click on that guy right there. And then you create a new one. You can either create it here or you can use the button at the top right-hand corner. You create the new one and then you're gonna name this. I'm gonna say this is gonna go to my YouTube channel. So I'm gonna put AM for Automated Marketer YouTube. You can name it whatever you like. Now we can have it go to a website link, which is what I'm gonna do, or have it go to a review link. The review link is very, very cool. If you own a restaurant or if you own any kind of business that deals with the public in person, this is a little plaque, you know, you get a little plaque that's made and put the QR code inside so people can scan it. That review link is a game changer. But for this one, I'm gonna do the website. So I I click on the website and then I hit the next button. Then I'm gonna paste the link to my YouTube channel, which I have right over here off screen, and I'm gonna just paste it. And it already creates it. Now, theoretically, I can just click next, 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 and be done with it and move on with my life. But there's some really cool things that we can still do with this QR code. So I'm gonna hit the next button. I can change the colors. So I'm gonna grab some colors that, my personal colors from my brand and my business. Okay, so I have a blue and I'm going to change my dot colors to that blue. And then after I do that, I'm gonna use the red to do the border. Do you see how that worked? Isn't that cool? I've got a little red border. Now my blue is a little dark. It might be hard to see on this screen. So I'm gonna click on this and I'm actually gonna just brighten that up a little bit so it's a little easier to see. Now those are for the dots that are inside, all right? And then I have the center ones and I'm gonna use the same color because I really want that blue to stand out, all right? And if I just click away from it, we should be able to see what that looks like with the different color changes. Might have to do it this way instead, all right? There we go. And as you can see, that blue is now matching. Hey, we wanna interrupt this video for a quick little minute to just let you know that I hope you're enjoying this video. We wanna thank you for being here, but more importantly, we are hoping that this content helps you do whatever you're trying to do inside a high level. We also want to let you know that you have options to get additional help. We offer a 197 a month VIP coaching program that includes four days of office hours, first come, first serve with Andy or myself, where we go in and we answer any of your questions that you might have live with the group setting for other people that are also working in high level. We also have a VIP group where we answer questions directly one-on-one -on -one with anybody posting in that group to give you the absolute best support. It also comes with a bunch of other features, including our funnel brick system, our little mini course, and more importantly, a couple guides that'll help you through this, and also including our SOP library that we use for pretty much everything inside of our agency. So thank you for this quick little minute, but more importantly, go back to the video, get whatever you need, and if you have any questions that we can answer inside the video, just drop a comment on the video and we'll make sure to answer whenever we get a chance. And now back to the show. Now, not only that, I also have the ability to change shape and form. So there's all these different choices of the way you can have it laid out. Isn't that cool? All these different kind of looks for the QR code. I'm gonna go with these little dots. I think they're really cool. I can also change the border on my markers. Do you see how that's a circle now? And then that's a square. Or I could change the dots that are inside. I'm gonna go with a rounded edge there with the square. Now, this part is one of the parts that I really like the most. I can add a logo. So I have a YouTube channel, right? I can put the YouTube logo. If it was Facebook, it would be Facebook. But this is a game changer. I can actually add my own logo, my own image, which is what I'm gonna do now. I click on this link here. I'm gonna click new upload. I'm gonna upload the file. And I have that file right over here. I'm just gonna drag it in and then I'm gonna drop it. Give it a second to load and then click on that. And then look, my logo, my little square logo is on the inside and that looks really, really cool. All right, so I, after I do that, the last thing I can do is I can play with my background. Now I could theoretically take an image and I'll use this image again and give it a background so that I have something now really, really cool that I can give out and put on a business card and I can even change the opacity to make it look a little bit more like a watermark or something like that. In this case, I am just gonna actually get rid of it because I just wanna have it on its own. And when I'm ready, I just click on download my QR code and it's ready to go. Ready to be used on business cards, ready to be used on review panels. It's a really, really simple, easy thing to use. But there's one last little part. If you click on analytics, and there's no data obviously because I just made it, you can actually see the visits that people made, how many QR scans you actually got. 
And then you can also see, you know, basically all the different links that you have made for QR codes. And then on this one, we could see individual ones. And then you have a choice between just funnels or just websites or just the QR codes. So that's a really cool thing that this new analytics feature has. All right, so it's a very simple tutorial this time. QR codes, I definitely think are a game changer and a lot easier to make. You no longer have to go to these websites and pay extra for them. They're built right inside of Go High Level. If you like the content that we're making and you like these kind of videos, don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.